They might be involved in the relegation battle rather than in the race for the championship, but Racing are one of only two sides to have beaten Real Madrid in the league this season. Beating them at the Bernabeu is a different matter, though. Del Bosque's men haven't lost any of their last 45 league games here, stretching back almost two and a half years. And it would be some testament to new owner Dimitri Piedemann and his coach Chuchi Kos if Racing masterminded Real's downfall today. Here's Luis Figo, free playing a decent advantage with two bodies to Figo's right. He won't play an advantage there, though, after Mora's foul. This will be a free kick in a promising position. After the challenge by the Racing defender. Some artillery to have in your side, both Zidane and Roberto Carlos from this kind of position. And it is Zidane! And Lemons saw it early enough to be able to palm it away. Zidane goes over for the often worked short corner with Luis Figo. Figo, Raul with a header, and Ronaldo, well, stretching, and the referee's given a penalty. Held back by Nehru, and Real Madrid have a penalty. Zidane with the free kick, which was initially saved by Lemons, and then from the resulting corner, Figo's cross headed goal bound by Raul, good save by Lemons. And Ronaldo with a tap in, hauled away by Nehru. He'd been able to stay on his feet, he would clearly have scored. But it is a penalty to Real Madrid, and Luis Figo takes responsibility. And scores easily to give Real Madrid an early lead here at the Bernabeu. Kept his head under pressure, Luis Figo. Lemons committed himself, and the Portuguese star calmly slotted it past it. Oh, missed kick by Ruben. Pavon is in behind him, he hasn't got it away either. Mike Casillas denies body pole from a tight angle. Well, he's making his first league start of the season tonight, Ruben, and only the second of his career. That will have done nothing to calm the nerves. Body poke might just have snuck it inside that far post, but Casillas easily able to keep it out. It's a man who's had the most telling contribution on the game so far, Nehru, who gave that penalty away. Ronaldo, such a clever turn. Now Roberto Carlos setting the sights from distance, beaten away for Ronaldo, off the bar. And then it seemed to strike Lemons and could have gone anywhere and squirted to safety for Racing. Ronaldo so close to number two that he will feel as though he should have scored. And he probably should have done. Foul by Makaleli on body Bowen. That has hurt the Racing striker. Seemed to twist his right knee as he fell under the challenge from Claude Makaleli. Nasty one for Body Pope. Well, that's the last thing that Dimitri Peterman and Chuchi Kos needed. One of the stars of the side being helped from the field with just half an hour played. Say out. Nafti with the foul. Big in for pace. Here you go with the free kick. And Zidane! What a header from Zidane Zidane! Real Madrid double their lead just before half time. Zidane not picked up at the far post. Great delivery from Figo. Look how much space Zidane had. Even so, making contact with the ball and diverting it inside that top left-hand corner was by no means a formality.
Racing scored three goals in the last quarter of an hour in their last away game, but there's a world of difference in being able to do that at Villarreal and here at the Bernabeu. You get the impression with Polipo having gone off and two-goal start for Real Madrid. This could be a long second half for Racing. Here's Nafti. Oh, it's deflected and it. And they've got one back in the opening three minutes of the second half. Ruben, the unfortunate defender. Came off his instep, wrong-footed Ike Casillas. Figo battling with Nehru. Zidane, strong challenge on him. Here's Roberto Carlos. Raul! Not by his own high standards, he would have expected to at least hit the target there, Raul. Some way wide in the end. Ruben dives in. Ruggiero fell. That'll be a yellow card for the 21 year old centre half. No Hierro, no Elguera, of course, today. And Ruben taking his chance. He hasn't been the most solid performance from him alongside Pavon. Comes the free kick, good header by Mora and a wonderful save from Casillas. Javi Guerrero just unable to capitalise on a very swift half chance to him at the far post. And it was a great, strong left hand from Casillas. The pressure on it to take it away. Good header though by Mora. Nafti. He's a ball to control the second pass that found a good one. Four for Javi Guerrero, but skied it well over the bar. Former Real Madrid youngster, unable to score on his return to the Bernabeu. Never actually played for the first team here. Good account of themselves in this second half of Asik. Certainly looked the more likely side to score the fourth goal of the game. That's a good ball forward, here's Raul. And Portillo in space to his right-hand side if he needs him. Here's Portillo, and that surely is the victory for Real Madrid. Well, Racing have had more of the play in the second half. Rail so potent on the counter-attack. One quality through ball. Raul was in. Grandma Colomina and Nehru all played him on side. And despite Lemon's best attempts, nothing he could do to stop Portillo getting his name on the score sheet. And with just 13 minutes to go, I'm sure that is the point safely wrapped up. Raul driving with so much pace and determination, but also awareness of what was around him. And that vision brought a goal. Now Solari, passing all of a sudden, looking stretched every time Raul pushed forward. Roberto Carlos just unable to reach at the near post. Great ball by Solari. Quite good enough. Movement ahead of the midfield for Real. Zidane made a run, but now instead he lets for Roberto Carlos. Solari back to Zidane. Raul, clever dummy from him. Gucci, what a finish! Real Madrid at their irrepressible best. Everything that's good about their play. Evident in that goal, movement, awareness, and sublime skill. Guti just showing the depth of resources that they have here at the Bernabeu. 
lovely play by Raul, the step over. And Guti bringing it back onto his left foot. 4-1. Zidane, Raul made a run for it. Zidane again. Raul. Solari. Flags up. Well, he's not happy with the decision, Sandy Solari. I think it's for a little pull back on the defender rather than the offside. Well, not the most fluent performance at times in the second half, but easy enough for Real Madrid in the end. There were defensive insecurities exposed, but the scoreline was a fairly honest reflection of their superiority. It's finished Real Madrid 4, but Racing Santander 1. Figo, Raul with a header, and Ronaldo, well, stretching. And the referee's given a penalty. Held back by Nehru. And Real Madrid have a penalty. Zidane with the free kick, which was initially saved by Lemons, and then from the resulting corner, Figo's cross headed goal bound by Raul. Good save by Lemons. And Ronaldo with a tap in, hauled away by Nehru. He'd been able to stay on his feet, he would clearly have scored. But it is a penalty to Real Madrid, and Luis Figo takes responsibility. And scores easily to give Real Madrid an early lead here at the Bernabeu. Kept his head under pressure, Luis Figo. Lemons committed himself, and the Portuguese star calmly slotted it past it. Oh, missed kick by Ruben. Pavon is in behind him, he hasn't got it away either. Naika Casillas denies Bodipo from a tight angle. Now he's making his first league start of the season tonight, Ruben, and only the second of his career. That will have done nothing to calm the nerves. Bodipo might just have snuck it inside that far post, but Casillas easily able to keep it out. Has had the most telling contribution on the game so far. Nehru, who gave that penalty away. Ronaldo, such a clever turn. Now Roberto Carlos setting the sights from distance. Beaten away for Ronaldo, off the bar. Bandage with two bodies to Figo's right. He won't play an advantage there, though, after Mora's foul. This will be a free kick in a promising position. After the challenge by the Racing defender. Some artillery to have in your side, both Zidane and Roberto Carlos in this kind of position. And it is Zidane! And Lemons saw it early enough to be able to palm it away. Zidane goes over for the often worked short corner with Luis Figo. They might be involved in the relegation battle rather than in the race for the championship, but Racing are one of only two sides to have beaten Real Madrid in the league this season. Beating them at the Bernabeu is a different matter, though. Del Bosque's men haven't lost any of their last 45 league games here, stretching back almost two and a half years. And it will be some testament to new owner Dimitri Peterman and his coach Chuchi Kos if Racing masterminded Real's downfall today. Here's Luis Figo, referee playing a decent advantage.